Hello and welcome to my YouTube video. In this YouTube, I'm going to play my four favorite songs from 1957. But before I do that, I'd like to review what was 1957 like. I was 13 years old and in the eighth grade in 1957. This is a picture of me and my four friends at my birthday party. This one's me. Dwight David Eisenhower was president in 1957. Russia launched Sputnik in 1957, and that caused a lot of panic and anxiety in America. The United States' first attempt to launch a satellite blows up on December 6th. Bad news. John Glenn sets a new transcontinental speed record in a FU-8 jet. Five years later, he would be the first American to orbit the Earth. The Brooklyn Dodgers moved from Brooklyn, New York to Los Angeles, California. Governor Orville Faubus of Arkansas calls out the National Guard to prevent nine black students from enrolling in the Little Rock Central High School. The Frisbee is introduced. And what's interesting is, where did it get the name Frisbee? It came from the Frisbee Pie Company. They made these pie plates and kids were tossing them and that's where the original idea for a frisbee came from from these pie plates made by the frisbee baking company so the first frisbee was by whammo bubble wrap was invented it was kind of an accident they were working on plastic wallpaper and they ended up with bubble wrap pop Pop, pop. Burger King introduces the Whopper in 1957. A 45 RPM record cost 79 cents. And I should know because I bought dozens of them. The words, In God We Trust, was first appears on U.S. paper currency. Killer bees escaped from quarantine into the wild, and everybody was worried that these bees were going to fly into America and sting us and kill us. It turns out they could only live in uh, warm climates, so uh, they were only available to invade the southernmost uh, states of Florida and Texas. And uh, I'm, I'm not aware of anyone dying from a killer bee. But we were, we were afraid. The United States accidentally dropped a hydrogen bomb in New Mexico. It didn't explode, but it landed on a cow and killed it. This stake marks the exact spot where that bomb fell out of that bomber and fell 17,000 feet into the desert. A Northeast Airlines plane crashes onto the prison Rikers Island in New York, and 57 prison inmates, at great risk to themselves, rushed to save the passengers. Those heroic prisoners were either set free or received a reduced sentence. Former President Harry Truman refuses to ride the Dumbo ride at Disneyland. And why would he do that? Because Dumbo was a flying elephant. 
and the elephant was the symbol of the Republican Party, and Harry Truman was a Democratic president. The computer language Fortran is invented. And a few years later in college, I would study Fortran. It was the first computer language I learned. Dream Whip is invented in 1957. Dick Clark's American Bandstand starts airing on television. And we all watched it faithfully. One of my favorite shows growing up. Elvis Presley buys Graceland in Memphis, Tennessee for $100,000. And now he's buried there and you can go and visit Graceland. It's a tourist attraction. My granddaughter Grace and her mother went there just a few months ago the musical West Side Story starts playing on Broadway in 1957. A gallon of gasoline cost 26 cents. A first class stamp cost 3 cents. What were the top movies of 1957? They were Bridge on the River Kwai, Peyton Place, which became a TV show after the movie, Sayonara, starring Marlon Brando as an Air Force officer in Japan. Search for Paradise, a Cinerama, a travelogue around the world, produced by Lowell Thomas. And Old Yeller, this one was guaranteed to make everyone cry. Old Yeller. The top songs of 1957 were... Jailhouse Rock by Elvis. Diana by the very young Paul Anka. One of my favorites. All Shook Up by Elvis. Great Balls of Fire by Jerry Lee Lewis. Unfortunately for Jerry Lee, he became very controversial. Uh, he ended up marrying his 13-year-old second cousin, which was a huge scandal. My mother forbid me to buy or play or listen to Jerry Lee Lewis because of this scandal. At the Hop by Danny and the Juniors. We had a local television show every Saturday afternoon called The Hop, and it was based on Dick Clark's American Bandstand. Kids would come and they would play records on uh, and dance on TV. And in fact, I got to go on The Hop years later when I was uh, president of the senior class in my high school. What were the most popular TV shows? Well, they were Gunsmoke. Matt Dillon, Miss Kitty. The Danny Thomas Show. Tales of Wells Fargo, another Western. Have Gun, Will Travel, Paladin. And I've Got a Secret, where a contestant would come on and they had a secret and this panel would ask questions 
and try to figure out what their secret was. John Lennon and Paul McCartney of the Beatles meet for the very first time at a church social where John was playing. And this is John Lennon, a very young John Lennon. Who was born in 1957? Well, Daniel Day-Lewis, the actor. Fran Drescher, the actor. Ray Romano, uh, television fame. And uh, Hans Zimmer. Hans Zimmer, you, you may not be familiar with him. He's a composer. But I can almost guarantee you have probably heard his music because let me show you what he composed the music for. He composed the music for Rain Man, for the movie Dune, for the movie Gladiator, for the movie Pirates of the Caribbean. He composed the music for Man of Steel, Blade Runner, The Prince of Egypt, the Da Vinci Code. He composed the music for Sherlock Holmes, Dunkirk, Inception, and The Dark Knight. He won numerous Academy Awards for his music. He composed the music for The Last Samurai, Samurai The Lion King, and Interstellar. So, if you've seen any of those movies, you have heard his music. The average yearly salary was $4,317 in 1957. A new car, on average, cost $2,095. This is a 57 Ford. A new home cost $12,220. President Eisenhower suffered a stroke on November 27th. He also suffered a heart attack years earlier. And now I'd like to play my four favorite songs from 1957. Enjoy.
Well, I'm tired and so weary, but I must go along till the Lord comes and calls me, calls me away. Oh, yes. Well, the morning's so bright and the lamp is alive. And the night, night is as dark as the sea.